Using Code Igniter is fairly simple. Just download the files and copy them into your project. You will find the application folder where you can find the config folder where you can find config.php with a, a general configuration. Make sure you specify your base URL and database.php with a configuration for using the database. Make sure you complete everything uh, specifically for your database so you can use the database. There are a uh, few more uh, configuration possibilities but we shall avoid them for now. Here you can find the controllers folder where you can find all controllers and the code you get when you take the CodeIgniter files includes the definition for the welcome controller. You will find this uh, file where you can find the definition for the class welcome a class that extends a CI underscore controller, meaning that uh, during the execution uh, an object will be instantiated from this class and it will be so function, it will function as a controller. You can already find the definition for index and here you can find code that actually forward uh, the execution to specific view. Its name is welcome underscore message and you can find that a uh, specific view over here within the views folder and if you access it you can find some text you can change for example over here we can find the title welcome to code igniter low code igniter uh, a low code igniter is something that I added let's change it into a low students now if we give it a try and try to access this way first the name of the machine on which the HTTP server is running then if the port is not 80 then specify the port the name of the web application it is actually a name of the folder inside the htdocs folder and then index.php and then we can specify uh, the name of the controller in our case is uh, welcome and we can specify the name of the action which is index and this is what we get we actually get a request sent from the web browser to the uh, server to the web application we develop using code igniter that request is uh, forward to the welcome controller and if to be more specific to the index action defined within the welcome controller the index action is actually a method we defined in our class the welcome class that extends ci underscore controller and then this code is executed and this code actually forwards the execution to a specific view its name is welcome underscore message a file a php file inside the views folder this is the file responsible for the view and here we can introduce few changes just to feel uh, how does it work given that welcome is the default controller and index is the default um, uh, action we can avoid specifying in this case welcome uh, slash index and get the same outcome we can even avoid index.php since index.php is set to be the default uh, file to be executed when trying to um, accessing the following URL address which is the URL address for the CodeIgniter web application